This will be my last reviewed video for a little bit. This will be my remake of my top 10 worst YouTube videos. Roll in the intro. As the title suggests, this is another remake of another 2020 ranking list video. Top 10 worst YouTube videos ever created. And how did I think of the 2020 video? Oh my lord, this video was terrible. It's my least favorite ranking video on this channel and one of the worst YouTube videos on this channel. First of all, the reasons for hating on those videos that are on the worst YouTube videos list have got to be one of the stupidest reasons to ever hate on a YouTube video. And I clearly threaded kid channels so much, I definitely treated them so badly back in 2020. But this video will pretty much just improve the video by a long shot. So here we are. This is my top 10 worst YouTube videos ever created. The rules are going to be exactly like the last video where I did the top 10 best YouTube videos. And these are all my opinions, so that's pretty much the same thing I say in every other video. Now, let's get on with the list. Back in my top 10 best YouTube videos, I said this. Also, Melanie was very enjoyable here. I love how Melanie actually cares about Axel, unlike some other video that I'll talk about in my top 10 worst YouTube video. And this is that video, the Melanie felony. This video clearly was made to annoy people on purpose, and I honestly hated it. The scene where Melanie is just addicted to a watermelon show wasn't bad, it was just not good. And then Axel shows Melanie the watermelon show about Apple Chan, and Axel makes a mistake of slicing a watermelon. Here's one thing that doesn't make any sense. How does Axel not remember that Melanie is still a watermelon? I know she is a human, but she was a watermelon in the beginning of 2020. So why does he think slicing a watermelon is a great idea? And the court scene was also insanely embarrassing. And we can't even forget about Melanie's character. Melanie was absolutely insufferable in this video. I absolutely hated her in this video. So then Melanie's new best friend is Bob, and for the rest of the video, Axel wants to try getting Melanie back. I know this might be surprising, but I honestly did not enjoy Bob in this video either. I don't think his appearance here was bad, but this is one of his worst appearances in an SMG4 video. And the ending of this video was kind of underwhelming, but it wasn't really that bad. So in my opinion, the Melanie felony is a train wreck disaster for a Valentine's Day special and is one of the worst Valentine's Day specials ever. You may think this video is not that bad on this list, but don't worry, we are just getting started. Oh my god, Shrek's Crappy Wish is one of the worst Mario torture videos ever. Yes, I hate this video more than Jeffy's bad word. The plot for this video does sound okay, but oh my god, the execution was so atrocious here. There's only one positive in this video, and it's the scene with Woody. I actually found this scene hilarious, but it dragged on for quite a bit, so I would only consider this scene okay. The rest of the video, aside from the Woody scene, was so infuriating to watch. Shrek asks Mario if he could ride on Mario's back, and Mario says yes as long as he turns back into Mario. And this basically breaks Mario's back because Shrek is over 400 pounds, and this basically just tortures him. The scenes that have Mario tortured are awful, but not terrible. The worst part of this video is easily the ending. Shrek would turn Mario back into a normal human being if Mario could drink crap through a straw. This ending actually made me throw up. But do you want to know what else is worse about this ending? That Mario did not have to drink the crap and Shrek only wanted Mario to drink the crap because Mario did not bring any toilet paper for him. I hate this ending so much and I also hate this video so much. Please do not watch this video if you are an SML fan. Jeffy's birthday surprise may take the cake for the most boring video ever. 
I actually fell asleep when watching this video. This is how it proves how boring this video is. The entire plot of this video is about Mario trying to get Jeffy a birthday cake, but the problem is Mario is so stupid in this video for no reason. He first grounds Jeffy for absolutely nothing. And what was the reason for? Breaking a bowl of cereal that Mario caused. And then Mario puts Jeffy in timeout for no reason. And the scene with Mario and Chef Pee Pee seriously dragged on and on. It literally lasted for three hours. So Jeffy was in timeout for something he didn't do for three hours. I hated this so much. You won't even believe how much filler is in this video. It is ridiculous. And many of you have complained about the ending of this video. Yeah, the ending was terrible, but I don't think it was as bad as the ending in Shrek's Crappy Wish. I hate how Brooklyn guy becomes incredibly selfish and only cares about his birthday instead of Jeffy's birthday. Every character in this episode is unlikable. Yep, Mario, Brooklyn guy, Chef Pee Pee, Cody, Chef Poo Poo, all of them. Except for Jeffy, surprisingly. Even though Jeffy is not a good character, I surprisingly sympathize with him. The question you all are asking is, why is this only placed at number 8? Well, there is a few funny jokes at the beginning I actually liked. But other than that, this video was so boring to watch. Hey, and I, don't I like hear you, bitch! <laughs> Lizzie the Radical 15 can be accurately described as one of the best Splatoon Gmod channels. There's a lot of really good videos on her channel, but some of the videos are also really bad. However, I have the most uncomfortable feeling when I watch a video like Trouble Date Parody. To me, this still is the worst Lizzie the Radical 15 video. And for good reason. This video does nearly everything wrong. The comedy here does not work. I may have laughed a couple of times throughout this video, but this video is so unfunny throughout. Also, another positive is that DJ Octavio returned in this video. He was actually pretty decent here. But seriously, the positives cannot save this absolutely abysmal video. Ah! Ready? Ah! No, no! And the ending of this video was also really bad. I can't believe Callie would actually turn into an alcoholic in this video. I can't believe how out of character she actually is. The only reason why this video is at number 7 and not in the top 5 like you expected it to be is that I am obsessed with this video. I love this video for how failure-like it is. I love talking criticism about this video so much that I might actually do a YouTube poop out of this. And that's why this is the definition of one of the worst YouTube videos ever. Please go check out my Lizzie the Radical 15 video to show my in-depth thoughts on this video. Jeffy's birthday surprise was originally my least favorite SML video, but not too long ago, in February of 2023, SML made Jeffy the sketch artist. I watched the video when it first came out and, oh crap. I can't even describe the levels of awfulness this video is. Jeffy keeps falsely accusing Mario of crimes he actually didn't even commit. I don't have a problem with this joke, but the problem is that this joke is the entire video. First Mario gets sent to jail for 30 days, then 60 days, and then 90 days. So that is a total of 6 months in jail. That's honestly just pathetic. I thought this would actually be a really clever and really cool video. But no, it is just repetitive, and you know how much I hate repetitive videos. If this video did not have Judge Pooby in it, this video would have been in the top 3 otherwise. But the great thing is that Judge Pooby saved this video from the top 5. And do you want to know how long this video is? It's 17 minutes of Mario torture. I know a lot of people would put their least favorite SML video as Cody's bad word, but I honestly thought the video was just bad. There were a few funny jokes I liked, but the video was just really repetitive. But for Jeffy the sketch artist, it is Marvin getting tortured non-stop in this video for six months. I hated this video so much, but I'm glad it's in, not in the top five.
If people are on the topic of fan-hated SMG4 videos, people usually mention boys versus girls as their first choice. I don't know how I thought this was okay originally, but I just hated this one. To be honest, I actually liked the first half. Where they have to go down a mountain was actually really cool. I actually thought this scene was decent. But eventually after the girls win, the video starts going downhill right after that scene. This video makes almost every character in this episode be as unlikable as they possibly can be. And oh my god, Maggie and Psycho were absolutely insufferable in this video. And Maggie is my favorite character, and this video made me absolutely hate her. I kind of felt bad for Tari because I knew she was actually sorry for what she has done. Well, other than the prank she did on Axel, that means Tari was just okay in this video. The entire second half is one of the most mean-spirited piece of garbage dumpster fires that I literally cannot stand. And the ending also gave me a reaction of, that's it ending? The ending was absolutely terrible. How are the boys even with the girls if Mario gets shot? This doesn't make any sense. I can't believe in this video, Maggie and Psycho were all at an all-time low. This is a definition of a bad video. In my opinion, this is the absolute worst SMG4 video ever. And a lot of people say that this is the release fair SMG4 video, so I'm not the only one who disliked it. I hope SMG4 doesn't make any more mean-spirited dumpster fires anymore like this episode. The only thing that actually saved this video was the first half. If this video did not have that first half being decent at all, this would probably easily be number 3 or 2 on the list. But the great thing is, this is only at number 5, and I do not want an SMG4 video to be at number 3 or number 2. Destroying Jeffy Puppet Prank is a mean-spirited piece of garbage and I hate every second of this. Literally, the prank part doesn't even come in halfway through the video. The entire first half is about Chili and Tito destroying a complete duplicate of the Jeffy puppet. And Logan's reaction was priceless, but the rest of the second half is about Logan swearing for the 50th time. It is so annoying to watch. And Logan goes on about this rant that Jeffy is the most important character on his channel and doesn't want Scooter to be the new main character. Here's a lot of problems I have with Logan's rant. First of all, in Jeffy's Bad Christmas, Mario said that Jeffy got the SML videos age restricted, which was accurate, and Logan still wants Jeffy in videos? How does this make any sense? Does Logan clearly want to get his videos age restricted again? I don't know, you tell me. I mean, Jeffy has improved now, but back then Jeffy was so bad of a character. Every time Logan talks in this video, I really just want to shush him so badly. Who the fuck is that? That's not fucking Jeffy, is it? That's not, the fu that's not a fucking real one. That's not the fucking real one. Yes, it is. Huh. It was a, you left him on the couch. What? No, where the fuck I didn't? Yes, you did. No, the fuck I didn't. I left him up in the fucking red room. On the fucking red... Keto, just tell me the fuck it was... This is why 2018 is my least favorite SML year. It is not 2020 because, yeah, there is a lot of bad videos in 2020, but 2018 had a lot worse videos and a lot of worse problems with Logan's channel. Honestly, I have no idea how anyone likes this video. I hated this one so much, but we have got three more videos that are worse than this. Videos that are worse than Logan swearing a hundred times throughout a video. Why are you a vegan phobic animal bully, Gordon Ramsay? Yep, that's the actual title of this video. This is basically a diss track that vegan teacher did out of Gordon Ramsay, and oh my god, it is literal atrocious. That vegan teacher is normally an awful YouTuber, but oh my god, this video made me absolutely hate her content. She's now my fourth least favorite YouTuber of all time. This video is horrible by literally everything it does. I don't really care for Gordon Ramsay that much. I mean, Gordon Ramsay is more like a meh YouTuber, but that vegan teacher has to show some graphic material in this god-awful video. If you really are vegan, then why are you showing some graphic material of animals getting tortured? This video sucks so hard in every way possible and made me hate that vegan teacher even more. Literally the only positive about this video is that this video actually got age restricted, which I am happy because this video deserves to get age restricted for this piece of crap. I hated this video so much, but there are two that are worse than this. The entire video is a nightmare to watch. If you really want to watch this diss track, watch at your own risk because this video is so bad. And 
And shocking news, Baby Shark Dance is not the worst YouTube video. But as number two on the list, it is so atrocious and annoying to watch. This video or music video features my least favorite song of all time. This video could have been creative and have the lyrics actually being catchy, but no, it is repeating the same thing over and over and over and over and over and over. How does anyone find this video enjoyable? It is so annoying to watch. And how is this even the most popular YouTube video? It literally has more views than the amount of people in the world. Well, I'm not a person, I'm an inkling, and I don't know how many inklings there are in Splatoon. I absolutely despise this video so much. And literally the best thing about this video is that this wasn't even the worst video. But there is one video that is at number one that is so bad that it's dominating literally every other video as the worst YouTube video ever created. But first, we have got ourselves some dishonorable mentions. The two COPPA videos were not as bad as I originally thought they were, but they're still bad. YouTube Copyright School is such an annoying Happy Tree Friends video, but not bad enough to be on the list. The Intruder, such an annoying SMG4 video to watch, but the video was not annoying enough to be on the list. Claude's wants Callie's butt, just one stupid joke, but this video was too short to put it on the list. IP Cack Drinking Contest, just gross, but the video was too short. Jeffy's favorite song, just one of the most annoying songs ever. Pregnant Jeffy, what the heck was this video? Joseph the Millionaire, just demolished Joseph's character for no reason. Jeffy's Kids, has no reason to exist. Cody's Bad Word had a few funny jokes that I liked. Now on to number one, the absolute worst YouTube video ever created. My three least favorite things in a YouTube video are gruesome content, repetitive content, and long videos. And they are all combined into this horrible video. Don't get me wrong, I don't mind long videos, but they have to be long for a purpose. And this video makes this video really long for no reason whatsoever. And this video pretty much explains how much I hate child abuse than baby basher. This was a clear and obvious number one because there's so much wrong with this video. This video was bad enough that it made Mako Sucks number two on my worst YouTubers list. And it still holds up. Also, I don't want to show you the video because the entire video is gruesome. I'm going to replace it with some Splatoon gameplay, an actual good game. Baby Basher is an absolute disgrace on the internet. Th this video is over 11 minutes long and it's repetitive and gruesome. That's literally the entire video is literally just killing babies. That is horrible. It is terrible. It's a waste of my time. It will waste other people's time if they ever watch the entire video. Besides, if anyone actually likes this video, then you are possessed. Because I do not appreciate anyone who actually likes this video. Because this video should be liked by literally no one except for, you know what I'm talking about. Mako sucks himself. The animation is terrible. The pacing here is really bad. The plot isn't even a plot, it's just killing babies and it's horrible. And the amount of repetitive activity in this video is ridiculous. It's so repetitive that it actually bleaches my eyelids shut. It repeats like hundreds of times throughout this 11 minute video. At least for the other videos that are on the worst YouTube videos list, they have at least one thing that is positive about the video or was just bad for the entirety of the video. Nothing more, nothing less. But Baby Basher is the first ever video I have ever given a video a zero out of 10. I've actually done this with Sarah Pop's friends, but I did not hate that video as much as I originally have. However, for Baby Basher, it is a complete abuse video that has nothing good about it. So Baby Basher is easily the worst YouTube video I have ever seen, and I hope it gets taken down. If you actually like that video, I cannot imagine how anybody enjoys stuff like this. Wow, this was the hardest essay I have ever given on a bad video. Well, here we are. This is the end of the video. This list was definitely easier to make than the last video, so... Thank you all for watching, Ghosto, and have a great day.